Hello everyone, and welcome to the update video for build number 92. While we've been hard at work on the Derail Valley Simulator update slated to come at the end of 2021 or early next year, we've also been working on a small quality of life build to be released in the meantime. Let's dive right into it. The biggest and most obvious addition is the newly revamped vegetation across the entire valley. From trees to bushes and grass, and even the rocks on the mountainsides, we've completely redone it all. While it truly changes just how the valley feels, with more lushness and detail, we took special care to keep the performance unscathed. With the overhaul to the flora, we've had to change up the vegetation settings in-game as well. The old Ultra is the new High, and your settings should auto-roll one step back to reflect that. Those with higher-end computers can crank up the settings and have an even prettier appearance, whilst those who would rather buy a used car than a new graphics card can still enjoy the new looks with a good frame rate. We recommend the High setting as the highest for VR, whereas non-VR players with GTX 1080 Ti's or higher can run it at the new Ultra setting at a solid 60 frames per second. Note that players with low-end hardware will also benefit from this update, as vegetation set to mega-low and very low levels will now render faster than it used to. In that sense, the new vegetation now covers a broader spectrum of performance for all kinds of hardware, and we will tweak it further as needed. Now playing Truckers FM! In build number 92, we're proud to add Truckers FM to the default radio stations that come preloaded with the Moonbox. Along with the new station, we've improved the boombox's compatibility with MP3 files, as well as added the ability to play WAV files, among other fixes and additions. An important fix, among many made, is a fix for trains being damaged when the game loads, caused by a consist being compressed when saved. Another very welcome fix is one many players have had happen at least once or twice. You can now grab your lighter off the firebox's sill without having to phase your forehead through the firebox walls. There are of course many more smaller quality of life fixes made in Build 92. From job booklet car count displays, to junctions highlighting when aimed at, and even being able to use money as money, we've tied up quite a few loose ends. That's all for this update. We're now returning to work on the simulator update, and we'll keep you posted on any upcoming updates. In the meantime, be sure to check out the new Community Unlocks page, recently updated with more details. So for now, drive safe, and we'll see you in the valley.